Hi, I'm James Porter, and this is the video on how to subtract single-digit numbers with A100 bead abacus. If you've just made your way through all of the addition videos, even maybe some of the challenge videos, you are in the right place. All right, subtraction is a little different than addition, where in addition you are adding beads together, you are moving more beads and more beads and more beads to one side. This time you're taking beads away. So the same as addition, we're going to start by forming the first number. Let's try our first example. We're going to try 8 minus 2. So like addition, we will form the first number, 2, 4, 6, 8. And since we have formed the first number, we will now take away the second number, 2. We will move two beads to the left side. It's a little different than addition, but close to the same. And in this situation, you wouldn't need to write down the number, but it is a little helpful, so I'm going to write down the number. We have 2, 4, 6. So therefore, your answer to this problem is 6. Your abacus should look something like this. All right, let's try another one. Let's try 6 plus 4, 6 minus 4, 2. Again, we'll start by forming the first number, 6. Then we're going to take 4 beads away, 2, 4. This leaves us with our answer. Easy enough to figure out. I'm still going to write it down just so you can see it a little better and so that just to get in the habit because writing it down later will be really helpful. In this situation, it's 2 two beads left. This is what your abacus should look like as well. All right, let's try one more before I give you some sample problems to try. Let's try 9 minus 5. Start by forming the first number, 2, 4, 6, 8, 9. We're going to take away 5 beads, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 2, 4. So the number we have left is 4. I wrote it down again. It's a good practice to get into, but not always necessary. Four is our answer. These are our beads. So now you can kind of see why addition is really close to subtraction, especially with the abacus. Now I'm going to give you some examples to try. I'll give you 10 seconds to try them. They may take you that short of time to solve them, but if, it, if you need more time, you can definitely pause the video. Let's start by taking seven minus Three. The answer you should have gotten was four, and your abacus should look something like this. Did you get it? Great job. Let's try three minus one. The answer you should get is 2, and your abacus should look something like this. Did you get it? Well done. Let's try one more example. Let's try 9 minus 7. The answer to this one is also 2, and this is what your abacus should again look like. You did a great job learning how to subtract single digit numbers with A100 bead abacus today. If you need more help, you can go through and see this video again, or I explained the examples in the, with the button below that says examples. I'm James Porter signing off for now, but remember, a broken abacus is no one's best friend because no one can count on it.